Hey everyone, see this box? I just did an unboxing. I attempted to do tips and tricks, but in reality, it's probably how not to use this product. This product is primo, really good, recommend it. But me trying it on camera without trying it first, you're going to laugh, at least I did. But I don't wanna do cuts, I don't wanna do things over again. I want to be real with you. So. Let's hit play and watch what mess I made. <laughs> um, but I have the link down below also for this product. Um, and I hope that you thoroughly enjoy this video. Have a great night. Hey everyone, it's Jennifer and welcome back to DP Addiction Adventures. I am trying out this new product. It is a desktop vacuum cleaner. And surprisingly, I have never used one of these or purchased one. This one is off of Amazon. Don't know if you wanna see it up close and personal. It's got a little rainbow on it. And what I loved about it too is it's rechargeable. I don't need batteries. This one I got in pink right here so let's open it up let's see if it works what I think of it I am working on my draggling my frostling from craftively and all right so it comes like this they give you a little tray they give you a little um, brush right here let's see what this is Okay, this, I think, is the cord. Oh, yeah, there's the cord. Okay. Oh, cute little cord cover. That's cute. All right, no, this is, we'll see what this is. <laughs> so here is the little vacuum. How adorable is this? It's so cute. And then you just undo there. They get sucked up here and they fall in there. What I like about this is, look, you don't see any of the innards. They're protected. Where other ones I've seen, there's um, the underlying things in there. And then I think that's the on button. Oh, does it have two gears? Let's see. Desktop vacuum instruction manual. Um, level on off button. So yes, it looks like it has two gears. All right, so let's try this. Oh, and when the vacuum cleaner is in normal use, the indicator light shows blue. When the electricity is insufficient, the vacuum cleaner stops working. Cool. The charging cable is USB. And this looks like it goes in here. You see, yeah. They call it a long suction nozzle. Oh, so there you go. Okay, so you can suck up the drills that way. All right. There you go. And that's what I think the little brush is for, is to help you get your drills out. Okay. So I'm gonna try this because this painting while I've been working on it, I've been spilling drills. And I thought this would be the perfect way for tips and tricks. You guys can watch me figure this out. So I chose white and I'm going to like shake, shake, shake. Oh, my arthritis messed up. Okay, so I'm gonna spill them. Let's see what happens.
So any of the drills that were not on the sticky came right up. I will fix that in a moment, but I wanted to show you. Let's say we spilt them over here. Make sure that one needs to go down because we don't want that one sucked up. That one just didn't get positioned right. Okay, there we go. So I'm gonna try it. It's too full, they start falling out. So let's open this. Oh look, Whew. they're a little staticky. Like I said, this, this is first time. I've never done this before. So this is uh, tips on how to or how not to do this. Woo. Wonder what it would look like if I turned it on right now. Woo. Let's not try it and say we did. Let's not try it and say we did. So these drills, I guess, got staticky from being in the vacuum because they weren't staticky before, but they're not wanting to come out without a little coaxing, which, you know, if you spill your drill once, it's not the end of the world, right? This kind of helps. I'm making a mess. I'm making a mess. All right, so then we'll do this part. Just kind of brush it off. So it fall where it may. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. I mean, it picks up really well. The only places it didn't pick up were on the glue part. And then I think the reason over here it didn't was because it was too full. So we're gonna try it again. It was just too full. So yeah, any part that's not on the glue, it came right up. And that's what we want. Um, yeah. So this would have been great at the beginning when I spilt this all over the floor, all over myself. You wouldn't believe how much I spilled. And my husband can testify how many nights I was like, what? Ah! And he's like, what? Like, I spilled again. He's like, oh, I thought the house was burning down. <laughs> oh, my goodness. So, um, I would recommend this. I will put the link down below. And it is on Amazon. And then that way, let me show you if it just spills on your table. Not on gluey stuff. Right here, if you just kind of spill them right here. I feel like I'm an infomercial. And then you turn it on. And the reason these are coming out is because it's too full. So this is ooh, high suction, but you will need to empty it from time to time for small spills. So I'm going to be cleaning this out. I'm going to clean up my mess because I put it on glue just to see, you know, are, would these little scrubbers work? Would they help it get off of glue? Well, the glue on a Craftably is strong enough that you're going to need to use your tweezers. But if it does spill on your table or it spills on a part that doesn't have glue, you guys have seen that it works. So I will put the link down below. Check it out. Super cute. They come in different colors, and I can't wait to see what color you get. I'm going to go charge this up, and I'm going to have it ready for the next time I spill. So until next time, be blessed. Take care. Love you all. Bye-bye.